I was going for my annual physical, and uh, my physician of about 15 years was was retiring, and he brought in a, a new guy to take over his practice. And one of the comments he made during uh, our first meeting was that he had noticed my PSA score was changing over the last five or six years. It gradually increased each year. Uh, so uh, it had gone like from 1.5 up to 2.7, 2.8 in about a four-year period. So he recommended that uh, maybe I should go see a urologist. And uh, so I did. It was about a half-a-day event. I uh, got down early that morning, uh, went through a brief enema, um, laid on my side on, on the diagnostic table. They go in and they uh, take a, a sample. I think I had about 12 samples taken. There's some loud popping as the machine is taking its samples, which here again, uh, it's an experience for you never having gone through that before. It doesn't really hurt. You just hear that little click all the time. You wonder what's going on. But it, it took probably about 15, 20 minutes, the actual procedure. When you go in to have your biopsy done, you're having multiple passes of a needle through the rectal wall and to the, into the prostate gland. And when that happens, you, you get a fair amount of inflammation around the prostate gland. So we always wait, like to wait at least six weeks from the time of the biopsy before proceeding with surgery allow enough time for the inflammation to, to cool down and let the tissue plans redevelop. 